Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord and glory, glory, hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Since I laid my burdens down. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Since I laid my burdens down. <laughs> you know, so many people, not insects, not mammals, not amphibians, not reptiles, have a condition called stupidity. I see now on social media where people try to make videos go viral and try to have something to say deep and they about as shallow as a kiddie pool. Therefore, you see a lot of people making a fool out of themselves on social media. My mom and dad used to say that common sense isn't so common, but ignorance is contagious. And I dedicate this message to those of you who are trying to make videos go viral, those of you who keep attacking uh, the president of the United States, regardless of race, creed, of color, or political party affiliation, those of you who keep on coming up on social media trying to be infamous or famous, and all you wind up doing in the end is making a fool out of yourself. It's a shame to put stupidity on layaway. It's a shame to wake up every morning to troll and put troll and to be a keyboard gangster. As soon as you log on, you ready to let somebody have it. If you cannot do anything with your husband or your wife, what makes you think you can do something with somebody else's husband or, or wife? If you can't do anything with your white teenage son, what make you think you can do something with somebody's black teenage son? If you can't do anything with your stepdaughter or stepson, what make you think you can do something with somebody else's stepson or stepdaughter? If you cannot do anything with your wife, how old do you think you can do something with somebody else's wife? You only have control over yourself. If you can't control your own husband, how are you going to control someone else's husband? It's called self-control and not remote control. So here it comes. Reverend Al Shopton, I hate to call y'all by name, but please come up front and center. You see, this is what you get when you try to be important, when you try to say something deep and it's shallow, when you try to uh, embarrass or inflict pain, inflict pain or injury on someone else with your words, and you mess around and injure yourself. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Is in the song. The name of the song is Respect. How can you misspell respect when the song is spelling the name of the word that you're trying to state? I'm sorry I had to do this. And Reverend Al Shopton, I hate to call y'all by name, but you call yourself out when you try to insult someone, when you try to make a name for yourself, you already got a name. Now, every time we see, uh, may she rest in peace and rest in paradise and rest in heaven, Sister Aretha Franklin's name is going to be associated with R-E-S-P-I-C-T. And this is all because someone already with a name, good or bad, tried to make another name for himself. And in the end, when you try to insult someone, when you try to get famous on the back of the name of someone else, when you try to injure and hurt someone all in a vain attempt to huh, get some likes, you're going to make an absolute fool and ass out of yourself. Glory, glory, hallelujah, since I laid my burdens down. Glory, glory, hallelujah, since I laid my burden down. The burden of stupidity, the burden of accountability, the burden of responsibility is on all of us. So if you want to continue to burden yourself with stupidity, being wayward and haphazard, keep on patrolling and patrolling the internet because you're under the influence of something. And more than likely it's not alcohol or anything else other than stupidity and pride. 
it's time for all these adult characters on this social media platform called LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, or whatever platform you invade with your stupidity. It is time for us to be adults. It's time for us to lead by example because the trickle-down effect is killing our children. Sometimes I wonder, who's married to this man? Who's married to this woman? Who's married to this individual? Who's married to this clown? Who's married to this angry person? Who's married to this fool? To sit back and watch your husband or wife or significant other or child or son or whatever do all this damage verbally, mentally, emotionally, uh, racially on social media. It is time. It's been time for a lot of grown-ups to grow up. It's a shame to grow old, but not to grow up. R-E-S-P-I-C-T. It's a shame when we, all we have to do is self-respect ourselves, grasp and grab hold to some self-control, and then and only then will the, will the stupidity stop on social media. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Try not to insult, injury, or assume, or assault anyone today. Have a wonderful day. Peace. One.